This lecture will give you an overview and detailed requirement to accomplish this project of the second order low pass filter. This is a great opportunity to consolidate the knowledge you have learned in this course. So far, we have learned so many things in our Python toolbox for LT Spice. The objective of this project is simply to use these tools. Here is a detailed project requirement. It is a second order low pass filter that we have learned before, but in this case, we are going to step over four different variables resistor 1 and 2, and capacitor 1 and 2. Here is the detailed project requirement. I break it down into detailed steps or tasks. Every task is relying on the building blocks we have learned in previous lectures. In the final solution, by just clicking the Run button in Python IDE, everything will be done automatically. The program you made will create LTSpice netlist in text files, run LTSpice simulation in batch mode in the background, read raw data into Python, plot the data and save as image files. Remember, everything is fully automatic. Among these tasks, some requires iteration in Python programming, which are not fully explained before. If you are new to Python, it is a great opportunity to learn about it. I would like to leave it to you to figure it out. If you have any questions, the most efficient way is to use Google as much as possible. Also, you can post the question in the forum in this course. Oftentimes, you will get my answer in 24 hours. This is a flowchart of automating LTSpice simulation using Python. It has been shown in the previous lectures many times. Working on this project, you will fully understand how to unleash the potential of LTSpice. If you got stuck somewhere, you can always go back and check the course materials. In my experience, struggle is good. It makes me step out of my comfort zone and helps me grow. Please begin to work on this project now and finish it by yourself. If you have any questions, please Google it first, and you are welcome to use QA section in this course. The solution will be given in the following lectures. Thank you and good luck.